Hi guys, Trisha here. Little off-season update for everyone. There's been a lot of excitement about our roster lately, but I just wanted to take the time to say farewell to two very special players for us here at FlyQuest. They've been with us for over two years, through the highs and the lows, and paving the way to two back-to-back -back finals in the LCS. Turtle helped kick FlyQuest off back in 2017 but also made an impact in esports content with his Turtle Talks as the first player journalist at Worlds 2018. Santorin joined very early as well, a true Cinderella story, as he blossomed into one of the best junglers in the LCS on a team that not many believed in. <laughs> That's no words that I can like describe how, how heavy I am right now leading us to our first world's appearance as a young organization. For us here at FlyQuest, we will be heading in a whole new direction, so please follow us for our exciting new developments. But for now, please join me in thanking two very special people, Jason and Lucas, aka Wild Turtle and Centaurin. Personally, I know they will continue to showcase greatness. Thank you. Honestly, my time at FlyQuest has been amazing to me. I think it couldn't really have gone better besides like maybe winning a, a trophy. Um, but in general, I came from a very rough place after H2K and I didn't really know what to expect joining FlyQuest. But since I joined, we've only been achieving more and more each season and I've been really, really excited for every single season playing with the players I love working with and uh, an organization I really like to play on. Um, so it's definitely a really bittersweet having to say goodbye. Aaron, 4, they gotta fight now, Solo's dead. Subjugate on Febbin doesn't even make Santorin that big. You see two going down, Flame and Febbin fall, Baron oh, low, oh, and it's it. gonna be the spike to Santorin. FlyQuest come up huge, a double kill for Wild Turtle. How did that Triple happen? Kill. It's a 3v5. When I joined FlyQuest, I definitely had a lot of goals to bring this team to be a good domestic performer. Um, Definitely struggled a lot the first two years I was on FlyQuest, but finally by the third year, I realized that dream and we ended up contesting, making it back to Worlds and doing what we had to do. Um, it's with a heavy heart to say that we're all splitting apart from FlyQuest and me especially, that I'm leaving this organization after three years. Uh, I've been on this organization longer than I have been on TSM, so it really holds a special place in my heart to be able to play here and in an org for so long. We're just going green and taking it one game at a time, pretty much. Honestly, guys, it's... Hard for me to say goodbye. I really, really like being on FlyQuest and all the fans, you guys have been amazing. I remember when I joined people, they've always been really supportive of me and that's something like I've not always had on teams in my past. And this is something that I hope you guys can continue to do where I'm going next, but also keep rooting for FlyQuest. The lineup is actually looking pretty good and I'm actually really excited to see how they pan out. So. I will not say goodbye, I'll say see you in the future. I want to give a big thanks to all the FlyQuest fans and Wild Turtle fans that um, helped me along this journey. It, it was a hard transition for me to be on FlyQuest in the beginning. Um, we eventually found our success in 2020 and I'm really glad you guys uh, stuck it out thick and thin. Uh, I hope you guys follow me whatever I decide to do next and I really appreciate you guys for always supporting me.